Alright guys, do not watch this video if you don't want nightmares tonight because today we are reacting to normal looking photos with disturbing backstories. Even I'm kind of scared to react to this guys, like, because this is real life we're talking about, disturbing real life stories. But anyways, if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe if you guys haven't already because we are on the road to 1 million subscribers. Photos that have Here a we go, guys. Backstory. I'm not oh, ready for this. This photo shows the Russian ambassador to Turkey, Andrei Karlov, who's doing a conference at an art gallery. The last the one? behind him is about to assassinate him. This Wait, photo was what? found on the- The man standing behind him is about to- Hey, yo, see? You can't trust the people closest to you sometimes, man. That was probably his bodyguard, too. ...to assassinate him. This photo was found on the camera of two vacationers who were swept away by the 2004 tsunami. Oh which my claimed god. The lives of over 240,000 people. The man who took the photograph of this bear is Darsh Patel, a 22 year old who went hiking with some friends. Shortly after taking it, oh, the bear. he was killed by the same bear. Bro, this picture was taken that's by why the you don't get so close. saw this 11 year old girl floating on a disintegrating Wait, what? float. Her whole family was murdered on a sailboat by the hired captain who left her to drown on the sinking boat. She That's drifted for four up. days with no food, no water. What kind of family just leaves you stranded in the ocean? Guys, I'm scared of the ocean. If you guys have seen my other ocean video, like the ocean is just a no-no place, man. Sunlight beating on her skin. When the captain heard she survived, he killed himself. What? Yo, that is so messed up. What? Normal looking the photos heck? with disturbing backstories, part two. Oh no, this Snapchat how many was the are last there? photo ever taken of Sydney. Ready Luke, for my date. A woman who was killed by her Tinder date. Her body was cut into 14 different pieces, and when it was brought back to the what? morgue, it was in six different bags. This what? Man was transferred oh my gosh. She was like, I'm ready for my date. And then you just end stories. up dying. This man was transferring oxygen tanks for 12 boys in their coach. He didn't have enough oxygen for himself, however, oh my and God. died after losing consciousness in one of the cave's passages. So he saved a lot of people, but he ended up dying. The man in this photo, Franklin Floyd, married a woman and had custody over her children while she was in prison for 30 days. The girl in this that photo guy looks is one of her children, crazy. whom Floyd kidnapped to start a new life with. He left the other siblings behind, and after this photo was taken, he went to another state, changed both of their names, and claimed her as his biological daughter. Later, he went on to marry her. What? That is so creepy. What the heck? Normal looking photos that have a disturbing backstory, part three. All Yo, the they were not lying when they said disturbing that backstory. Was recommended to me by this really cool app. These Click are the scary in my guys. Right after this photo was taken, a bomb went off in the red car beside the boy on his dad's shoulders. The boy and the father miraculously survived. However, the cameraman and 28 others died. Yeah, all these people right here, they probably didn't survive the bomb. Died while 220 people were injured. Wow. The woman in red standing on the railing is a Japanese exchange student. Right after this photo was taken, she lost her footing and was swept over Niagara Falls and fell to her death. What the man in this the, photo is so David Johnson. Scary. 13 hours before the eruption of Mount St. Helens in the 1980s. Oh wait, I think I've seen His this last words picture. over the radio were Vancouver, Vancouver, this is it. Before he passed away and his remains were never found. The well, man I mean, in this photo it, it's is an Tyler eruption. <laughs> who just before this photo was taken, murdered both of his parents and left their dead bodies in the house and proceeded to throw a house party. Bro, what? Yo, some people are just so twisted. Like their brains do not work normally. Part four. Psychopaths. This is former NBA player Mark Jackson's basketball card. In the background are the Menendez brothers. They're sitting courtside shortly after killing their parents and just before getting arrested. What? <laughs> Yo, what the heck? And they got captured on a basketball card too. Oh my, it's the, these two, I bet, I, I think. These two killed their parents? They're sitting courtside shortly they after gave birth killing their to parents you. and just before getting arrested. Oh. The 17-year-old who took this photo told his family members that he planned to hike the stairway to heaven. He texted multiple pictures Wait, what is before that thing his disappearance, right and shortly is after, Bigfoot? the family noticed a man in this photo. While this photo may seem like an ordinary picture of footprints in the sand, they actually belong to a four-year-old little girl who <gasps> shortly after this photo was taken, Aww. drowned in the ocean. Aww. The two brothers in this photo are at Sequoia National Park. I mean, National the water was probably really cold as well. This photo was really taken well. they were both struck by lightning and both shockingly survived. What there is the a heck? tradition in Victoria, That's not disturbing England, at to all. take photos of dead people, I mean, often dressed in their best clothes, and pose as if they were taking a family portrait. Wait, what? If you what? look at this photo for long enough, you'll notice something is a little off about one of the children. Wait, what? Are they dead? What? Often dressed in their best clothes, and pose as if they were taking a family portrait. 
If you look at this photo for long enough, you will notice something is a little off about one of the children. Dude, so all these kids are dead? Oh my gosh, poor children, dude. A normal family photo. Just below the wife is a rattlesnake about oh. to strike her arm. Oh my gosh, yo, the snake was already in biting motion. Did she die? She was bitten and survived, but the dog died. Oh my goodness, these are so scary. I don't know if I can keep watching them, guys. Uh. A disturbing backstory, part six. This photo shows a man and a woman on the 70s game show, The Dating Game. The man in this photo who won the date with the woman is Rodney Alcala. He ended up killing girl. her or something. Cheryl what? Bradshaw, the woman, found him extremely creepy and after the camera stopped rolling, refused to go on a date with him. Uh -oh. Possibly saving her life. This shows George W. Bush receiving news of the 9-11 attacks while reading to a group of school children. Oh, yeah, I've heard. Like I, I think a lot of people he have already just got heard arrested about that. after killing 77 people and injuring 250 more. Oh, he my goodness. Island where a youth camp what did he do? He started shooting at random. Children what? who didn't know he was the shooter went to him for protection because he was dressed like a cop and he <gasps> shot them what imagine thinking that person was a cop and running towards him even though he was the person killing everyone immediately their only form of escape was swimming off the island boy in this photo is estevan reiner the nazis who took his photo made him put this uniform on smile for the picture yeah he doesn't exactly look very happy name. guys he looks like Two he's weeks been later he was killed in a gas chamber a similar what? story for this girl whose photo was just taken by a nazi yeah, he looked like he was being Germany forced to smile poland you can tell by her smile that she had no idea what was to come. Oh, this photo no. shows three young girls smiling together for a selfie. Wait, what is that thing right behind? On the right hand side of the photo, you is can see train? a light, which is the headlight of a train, which hits <laughs> them moments later. Yo, All this photo how do you not? How the heck do you not see the train in your phone? Like what? To be just an ordinary large. And can't photo. you hear the, the train two boys coming? At the top left are responsible for the Columbine High School shooting. What? Which at the time was the worst high school shooting in American history and killed That should have just stayed as the worst shooting in, in American history. Why are there so many Normal school shootings? I don't have get a disturbing it. backstory, part nine. While some people may find oh, clowns frightening, I hate clowns. they're still I hate clowns, normal. Guys. This photo shows nah, John Wayne nah, Gacy nah. or Pogo the Clown. Nah, the moment I see a clown in a picture, I'm out of there. It, it, even if I see a clown in real life, I'm out of there. I actually don't think I've ever seen a clown a in real life. serial killer <laughs> and rapist in the 1970s. Huh? Gacy was convicted of sexually assaulting and murdering over 30 boys and became known what as the, the Killer Clown. Ronaldo Doxa, a wait, wait, wait. The Philippines. Doesn't that guy have a gun in his hand? You guys see that guy the in the on the left side? Right before he was assassinated on New Year's Day in 2011. The man in the back shot him twice while his family what? was forced to watch. The man holding the puppy is Yuki oh my Arata, God. a kamikaze pilot who just one day later would crash into the USS Brayan, killing 66 of the crew members and taking his own life. Oh Yuki was only 17 years that old. Look at that little puppy well that right there. To his death the next day. The smiling man in this photo is Nazi Joseph Goebbels, who is in a 1933 League of Nations meeting, and in the next photo, his expression completely changes. His expression changes oh. from cheerful to hatred because oh. someone told him that the photographer was of Jewish descent. Wow, wow. Oh my gosh, that's actually was so bad. A group of students All right, this one seems to be like a nice group the photo. They left. Wait, they what, what the heck is that right there? You guys see that black dot one up of there? One the boys was missing and discovered the top of his head in the background of one he of the He was drowning? Photos. They contacted the police who found his dead body floating. Oh my gosh, he this drowned. This photo shows a starving little girl trying to reach a feeding center oh, when a no. vulture landed nearby her oh. waiting for her to die the photographer kevin was told not to touch any of the children out of fear of getting a disease in the victorian oh era families he could have saved that relatives kid. and take pictures with them you can see that the image of the mom and the dad is blurry because they had to wait for the camera shutter to cycle but the daughter's photo is perfectly clear because she died this photo shows jesse mcbain and his girlfriend patricia mann on their way to a valentine's day dance guys i don't want to watch this anymore to their dorms their roommates called the police who found their bodies tied up in the woods three Both days of them? later they have been tortured and died side by side. What? what seems like a cheerful teenager is actually 17-year-old Jeff Franklin. Who killed them then? Who just used a hatchet and a sledgehammer to murder both of his oh parents my. and injure several of his siblings. Dude, what's with, what's with people killing their own parents, guys? I, I don't understand. Like, they gave birth to you and everything. Like, oh my god. I don't even know, guys. But I don't want to watch anymore. <laughs> these, these were a little too scary for me, guys. And I hope these didn't scare you guys too much. But yeah, these were normal looking photos. They looked like some of them most of them look pretty normal but they had really disturbing backstories to them but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe if you guys haven't already but other than that i'll see you guys next time peace